I'm Kachan Kevin. Today we wrap up our series of reflections on the Beatitudes with Matthew 5.10. Blessed are those who are persecuted for righteousness sake, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. We can relate to this Beatitude as we hear in the news these days about Christians being persecuted all over the world for their faith and we pray for them. However, although we may not experience a bloody martyrdom, we are usually persecuted for defending the church's position, especially when it is against the worldly view on subjects such as abortion and same-sex marriage. But this should not surprise us. As Jesus tells us in John 15:19, If you belong to the world, it would love you as its own. As it is, you do not belong to the world, but I have chosen you out of the world. That's why the world hates you. Even St. Paul says in 2 Timothy 3.12, In fact, everyone who wants to live a godly life in Christ Jesus will be persecuted. The reward for this beatitude, which is the kingdom of heaven, is the same as the first beatitude. Catholic author Peter Kraft says, Persecution has the same blessing as poverty because persecution is a form of poverty. Poverty not of money, but of love that is, being loved. Both money and love are blessed only when they are given. It is more blessed to give than to receive. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, look with compassion on all those who suffer persecution for righteousness' sake and grant them the grace to carry their cross. Grant those who persecute the light to see the truth and have mercy on them, for they do not know what they do. Amen. If you would like a recap of the Beatitudes or the virtues and gifts of the Holy Spirit, visit our YouTube channel, Redeemed for Worship, and subscribe to our free Lenten Nuggets at www.redeemforworship.com. This Lenten Nugget is brought to you by Redeemed for Worship. It was there by faith I received my sight And now I am happy all the day. Created using Powtoon.